have a nice time today let us find the order of some elements in given factor groups first problem is find the order of 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 in set all over cyclic subgroup generated by 4 so set all contains the element 0 1 2 etc 11 and we have the subgroup which is cyclic subgroup generated by 4 which contains the elements 4 8 0 of set all so clearly this cyclic subgroup generated by 4 is a subgroup of set tool. And if you write all the cosets of this subgroup in set tool, we will get this factor group set tool over cyclic subgroup generated by 4. And in set tool, there is an element 5. And if you write all the cosets of cyclic subgroup generated by 4 in set tool, there will be one of the coset containing this element. And clearly that coset is 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 because in our general notation if G is a group and H is a subgroup of G if we write the coset of H in G containing the element A belongs to H it is actually represented by AH similarly here 5 is an element in set tool and the coset of cyclic subgroup generated by 4 containing the element 5 is represented by 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 so this is an element in this factor group. We have to find the order of this element in this group. Order of the element means that we have to find the least positive integer n such that n times 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 gives the identity element in this factor group set to all over cyclic subgroup generated by 4. And which is the identity element here? It is clearly cyclic subgroup generated by 4. In any factor group G over H, the identity element of the group is H. Likewise, here the identity element in set to over cyclic subgroup generated by 4 is cyclic subgroup generated by 4. So here we have to find the least positive integer n such that n times 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 equal to cyclic subgroup generated by 4. Note that the cosets in the factor group are operated in this way. AH into BH equal to ABH. So if you do AH into AH, it becomes A square H. So here A square means that it is A star A. With respect to the operation in G, the meaning of A square varies. As per this definition, I can write here N times 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 equals N times 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 equal to cyclic subgroup generated by 4. Also note that a coset A plus H equal to H means that the element A belongs to H because A plus H means that the coset of H containing the element small a and it is equal to H means that A belongs to capital H. Therefore here we can write N times 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 equal to cyclic subgroup generated by 4 means that n times 5 belongs to cyclic subgroup generated by 4. And this cyclic subgroup generated by 4 is actually 4, 8, 0. Since this is a subgroup of set 12, 4 raised to 1 is 4, 4 raised to 2 is 8 and 4 raised to 3 is 12 which is equal to 0 in set 12. So we will search for the least positive integer n such that n times 5 becomes one of the elements in this set. So clearly n equal to 4 because 1 times 5 equal to 5, 2 times 5 equal to 10, 3 times 5 equal to 15 which is equal to 3 in set all and 4 times 5 equal to 20 which is equal to 8 in set all and this belongs to cyclic subgroup generated by 4. So 4 is the least positive integer such that n times 5 belongs to this set. Therefore, order of the element 5 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4 in the given factor group equal to 4. So this is the general way of finding the order of a given element in a factor group. So let's do some more problems. Next problem is find the order of 2, 1 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 1, 1 in the factor group set 3 cross set 6 over cyclic subgroup generated by 1 1. Here the group G is set 3 cross set 6. 
and subgroup H equal to cyclic subgroup generated by 1 1 is equal to first element is 1 1 itself then 1 1 star 1 1 is 2 2 1 1 star 1 1 star 1 1 is 0 3 because 1 plus 1 plus 1 we are doing in set 3 so this is equal to 3 when divided by 3 which gives the remainder 0 so the first coordinate becomes 0 second coordinate we are doing in set 6 therefore 1 plus 1 plus 1 equal to 3 in set 6 so the third element is 0 3 again we are adding 1 1 here so we have 1 4 then 2 5 again 2 plus 1 is 3 which is equal to 0 in set 3 and 5 plus 1 equal to 6 which is 0 in set 6. Again if we add 1 1 we will get these elements repeatedly. The whole cyclic subgroup generated by 1 1 contains these 6 elements. Now we have to find the order of the element 2 1 plus cyclic subgroup generated by the element 1 1. That is we have to find the least positive integer n such that n times 2 1 belongs to cyclic subgroup generated by 1 1. I am not repeating the theoretic part here. The reason for taking such an n is just as in the previous example. So here we may note that when we take n equal to 1 the element is 2 1 itself. It doesn't belong to the set H. Now we take 2 times 2 1 it gives 4 2 which is actually equal to the element 4 in set 3 is 1 and the element 2 in set 6 is 2 itself. But the element 1, 2 doesn't belong to H again. And if you find 3 times 2, 1, it's equal to 6, 3, which is actually equal to 6 in set 3, which is equal to 0, and 3 in set 6, which is equal to 3. And we may note that this element belongs to H. Therefore, we can conclude that the least positive integer n such that n times 2 1 belongs to cyclic subgroup generated by 1 1 is n equal to 3. Therefore, order of the given element in this factor group equal to 3. Another problem of the same type, find the order of 3 1 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 0 2 in the factor group z4 cross z8 over cyclic subgroup generated by 0 2. Here the group G is Z4 cross Z8. First of all, we have to enumerate all the elements in H, which is cyclic subgroup generated by 0, 2 here, which is equal to 0, 2. Again, if we add 0, 2, we will get 0, 4, then 0, 6, then 0, 6 plus 0, 2 gives 0, 8. But in Z4 cross Z8, it is 0, 0. 8 is equal to 0 in Z8. Now we have to find the order of this element. 3, 1 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 0, 2. That is, we have to find the least positive integer n such that n times 3, 1 belongs to cyclic subgroup generated by 0, 2, which is h. We may note that 1 times 3, 1, 2 times 3, 1 or 3 times 3, 1 doesn't belong to h. h is here. These three elements doesn't belong to h. But if we take 4 times 3, 1, it's equal to 12, 4 actually, but 12 in set 4 is equal to 0 and 4 in set 8 equal to 4 itself. This element 0, 4 belongs to H. Therefore, we can conclude that order of this particular element equal to 4. And the last problem, find the order of 2, 0 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4, 4 in set 6 cross set 8 over cyclic subgroup generated by 4, 4. Here the group is set 6 cross set 8 and the subgroup H equal to cyclic subgroup generated by 4, 4 which contains the first element 4, 4 itself. Now 4, 4 plus 4, 4 gives 8, 8 but the first coordinate 8 belongs to set 6 which is equal to 2 and second coordinate 8 belongs to set 8 which is equal to 0. So second element is 2, 0 etc. There is no need to find other elements in this subgroup because we are asked to find the order of the element 2, 0 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4, 4 and 2, 0 is one of the elements in H itself. That means that the least positive integer n such that n times 2, 0 belongs to H is n equal to 1 itself. Therefore, here order of the element 2, 0 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 4, 4 is 1. 
here there is a problem for you to work out find the order of 3 3 plus cyclic subgroup generated by 1 2 in the factor group z4 cross z8 over cyclic subgroup generated by 1 2 for your reference the answer is 8